Hello future weight loss winner. Welcome to this video on why you don't want to go work out, why you're not feeling motivated. Maybe you think you should be exercising and working out the body and getting some physical activity in, but you just don't feel like it and that can lead to feelings of shame and guilt and lack of motivation and a whole downward spiral of an experience. So I'm Lexi with Lexi's Healthy Dynamic Life. Welcome to this video. Thank you so much for choosing to tune in with me. I really appreciate it. And I'm going to share with you a little bit about my story and then some tips and reasons that might resonate with you. So as many of you know, but if you don't know, I grew up dancing since I was three years old and I'm going to be turning 30 in just a few weeks. So I've always been moving many days a week. It's been my joy, my life, and I love it so much. So if there are any dancers out there, hello. Or if you just like to move your body, hello. And if you don't like to move your body, hello too, I see you. Because I fluctuated weight throughout my whole life. I was really self-conscious about my weight and my figure. We competed in dance, we did recitals, and I just chose to be really conscious of my body size. And so recently, a couple years ago, I started to gain weight really rapidly, and I gained 70 pounds. And so I felt really heavy. Like I literally felt like I was carrying the weight of the world on my shoulders. I also started to experience a whole variety of ailments. I was constantly in pain. My muscles ached, like especially my neck, shoulders, back. My joints were always painful and achy. My knees, my hips, my ankles. Like it literally hurt to stand for a, more than two seconds. So I was always sitting down or lying down or just kind of like plopping around. And so I knew that I should be doing some exercise, but it was so much effort and it hurt so much and it just took so much energy out of me. So my fiance has a degree in exercise science and when we met, we were like really active and going for hikes and going swimming, but I just didn't feel like it anymore, right? I was carrying so much weight that to go for a walk was like, such a task so i didn't want to so i don't know if you can relate to this at all like if you feel like you want to be moving but you just don't feel like you have the motivation or the willpower or the strength to do so and no matter what i did i tried i would like set alarms and remind myself to do a plank or to try to do a short yoga class or just have a dance party but i felt so winded and in pain that i couldn't justify doing that again. So that was my journey. If you can relate with that at all, let me know in the comments and I hope these tips will help you. So the reason that it's not easy to move the body or to work out or to exercise is because the body doesn't have any energy to do so. If we had the energy to do so, it would be easy. Does that make sense? So when we're eating foods that are processed and denatured and cooked and they take energy they take all the energy available to the body just to digest so all the available energy the body has has to be directed to just digest and eliminate the food because it's not really food right we're eating it like it's food but it's not fuel food is fuel so we're eating these food like things and the body is like all right Every little ounce of energy, go digest and eliminate this. Get it out of here. It's clogging up the system. It's taking up too much time. And when we keep eating these food-like substances over and over and over again that take energy to eliminate, sometimes we're eating, 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 eating. We don't have time to digest and eliminate. So it actually stores it on the body to deal with it later. And so that is why we don't have the energy to work out. It's not that we lack some special brain power, motivation, or willpower, because that would be crazy if <laughs> some people just were like gifted with motivation and other people weren't, that'd be so terrible. It's literally what we're putting into our body equals what we get out. So 
when I switched to eating a low fat whole raw plant food diet, high in fruits with some raw veggies in there, the first day, the very first day I ate fruit for breakfast, I felt 10 pounds lighter. And even though the scale didn't say I was 10 pounds lighter, the feeling of being 10 pounds lighter is like, oh, it's amazing. And because of that feeling, because I was giving myself the energy through the food, through the fruit, through the fuel, I felt like moving my body. I felt like working out, exercising, going for a walk. It was amazing. So if you are struggling with losing weight, if you are in a frame of mind that's like, I should be working out, I should be going to the gym, I should be exercising, but it's just too hard, I don't feel motivated, the solution is very simple. It's just change what we're eating. Eat fruit for breakfast, eat fruit for lunch, or eat a salad, eat, at least eat fruit for breakfast and eat raw till four, bare minimum. If you want like to kickstart your journey and get to the finish line as soon as possible and then experience the joys of optimum health and vitality and energy, go fully raw. It is just night and day. And I wasn't even eating vegetarian or vegan when I made the switch. I was eating omnivorously too. I was eating meat and animal products and uh, processed foods and greens and cooked foods and all the stuff, all the stuff I was eating. So if you're thinking like, oh my gosh, it's gonna be too hard. It's not hard and it's amazing. I feel so much better that I wouldn't have it any other way. From going from in pain, constant joint pain, muscle aches, um, headaches, GI distress, IBS, depression, anxiety, and eating those foods to energize and practicing yoga and being able to run or walk if I want to, dancing again, teaching dance again, having a positive outlook on life, which would you choose? So if you are feeling like you don't feel like working out, guess what? It's not your fault. You have nothing wrong with your brain. Just change what you're eating and I promise you, you'll have that energy and you'll get to work out. It's not even like you have to work out. You can still lose weight by eating whole raw plant foods that are low in fat and by sitting on your bum all day. It's possible and it has worked. If you haven't heard, go listen to my interview with Jillian Stenzel on my podcast. I'll put the link in this description as well. And, but you get to actually enjoy moving the body because that's what life is about, right? Like it's about enjoying life, dancing, running, having fun, if that's what you wanna do. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful for you. Please give it a thumbs up if you liked it or a thumbs down if you didn't like it. And write in the comments below what you'd like to see more so I can create more content just for you. And be sure to subscribe to Lexi's Healthy Dynamic Life and hit the notification bell. Otherwise you won't know that I made a new video. And with that, I am so grateful that you have decided to share your time with me and watching this video. And I wish you a happy, healthy, and dynamic day.